Good afternoon. This is Glenn with the National Weather Service in Tucson. Uh, we're here right on the roof of our uh, building here on the University of Arizona. It's about 4 p.m. and we're about ready to do our balloon launch uh, for the afternoon. We do these twice a day. Uh, you can see the balloon in the tub. Uh, we inflate it with helium. Uh, and we've already done so and it's it gets pretty big at this point uh, when it's ready for release. You can see we have a uh, parachute attached to it, and then Emily is the one who's going to be doing the release here momentarily. We have an instrument that's attached to it. It's called a radio sound, and basically what this instrument does is it measures atmospheric uh, uh, pressure, temperature, uh, wind, uh, uh, humidity, and all these atmospheric variables, and once the balloon is released, uh, those get back, sent back down to our office and we receive that data in real time. Now when the balloon is released here momentarily, uh, it's going to go up to about 100,000 feet before bursting. And as it does so, it keeps expanding and, span and expanding because the atmospheric pressure as you go up uh, is less and less, so it enables the balloon to get bigger in size. So by the time it gets to about 100,000 feet, it's about the size of a small car. Uh, then eventually it bursts and uh, we have the parachute that's connected to it and uh, so the parachute will open up and it'll float back down to uh, earth uh, uh, fairly quickly and usually land uh, somewhere and there is actually a mailing packet in our radio song that uh, could be mailed back to the office so Emily's about to release it and there it goes and uh, so it's up up and away and uh, Today we have a fairly low cloud deck, so uh, it's going to get to the clouds pretty quickly and uh, we're going to watch the data as it comes in downstairs and all this data is fed into our computer models and uh, that's what we use to help us forecast the weather. Hope you enjoyed the video. Have a great day.